Okay, we'll find the most general form of the antiderivative of this. So we have x times 12x plus 8. Do not use the reverse power rule right away because x times the 12x, well, the exponent is going to be affecting each other, right? So this is what we actually have to do it. First of all, distribute. So x times this, which is 12x squared, and then this times this, which is plus 8x, like this. And then we can reverse the power rule. I'm going to write down capital F for the antiderivative of that. So I'll write down f of x is equal to, well, to do the antiderivative of this, we can just go ahead, add 1 to the power first, and 2 plus 1 is of course 3, and divide it by the new power, I'll put it down here. So here we will get 4, and then x to the third power. And then for this one, this is x to the first power, so I'm going to add 1, and of course that's 2, and we have to divide it by the new power, so divide it by 2 right here, so 8 divided by 2. Again, we get 4, and then this is x squared, like this. So this is how we do the reverse power rule, and because we're finding the antiderivative, in the end, don't forget the plus c, and we're done.